And breaking news at 6 o'clock, at least four football players have been shot outside of the Roxborough High School campus. And in the last few moments, we have just learned a 14-year-old who was shot in the chest has died. This is Eyewitness News at 6. Good evening, everyone. I'm Yuki Washington. And I'm Jessica Cartalia. Carrie Carrado arrived at the scene a short time ago. She has been talking with investigators. She's live with an update from police. Carrie, what can you tell us? Jessica Yuki, that's right. We just got here. We are told four people are shot, and they are all believed to be a part of a football team. This scene is very large. We are told a 14 year old is dead. That is the newest information that just came into our newsroom. Now, we are still working to confirm what football team the victims are a part of because we are told three teams were scrimmaging at the time of the shooting. This happened around 4 40 p.m. when the players were walking off the field. Police say a car drove up and started firing. Again, we are told a 14 year old is dead. Now, this is a very large scene with police everywhere. Roads are taped off, so traffic very difficult in this area. Police say this all happened in the back of Roxborough High School near Fairway Terrace. We are also told parents who are watching this and looking to reunite with their kids, they can meet at 6401 Ridge Avenue. Police are there and can help them reunite with their children. Now, we are told all of the victims were taken to local hospitals, Temple and Einstein Hospital. We are still working to learn more about what happened here. We are awaiting an update from police, but the newest information to us is that a 14 year old is dead. We're live tonight. Carrie Carrado, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. All right, Carrie, this is heartbreaking. And again, parents urged to go to 6401 Ridge Avenue to uh, reunite with their students. Thank you. Carrie, thank you so much. We